Hi there, and welcome to Quick Tip Tuesdays. Chances are you have heard the term SEO, but may or may not know what it means. Today we'll be answering the question, what is SEO and why is it important? SEO is an abbreviation for search engine optimization. By definition, SEO is the process of maximizing the number of visitors to a particular website by ensuring that the site appears high on the list of organic, not paid for, search results returned by a search engine, such as Google, Bing, or Yahoo. SEO helps to ensure your website is accessible to search engines and improves the chances your site will be found, helping you stand out from the herd. Good SEO techniques and strategies can get your website bumped up in these organic search results, thus increasing your page rank and the likelihood of someone visiting your website. Let me quickly show you the difference between organic search results and paid for ads. So if we go to Google and type in t-shirt printing Seattle, we'll come up with some results and see at the right side of the screen and at the top of the screen on the search engine results, there's little orange icons that indicate ad, and those are the paid for advertisements. The ones below that are the organic results, and that's what we're trying to target here with good SEO. But just how important is it for your website to show up at the top of Google in these organic search results? Internet users have proven that they are not likely to click through pages and pages of search results, so where your website ranks in a search engine is essential for driving traffic to your website. The higher your website ranks in organic results, the greater the chance that the site will be visited by a user. In fact, the first organic result in Google searches gets around 20% of the clicks. So if your search term is searched, say, 100,000 times per month, that is 20,000 users clicking on your website per month. Basic SEO practices should be baked into your website upon development and are looked upon as part of the standard web development process. These basic practices are commonplace for professional web development firms and should be included with any new website. The most basic and easy to implement SEO techniques include adding page titles and page descriptions. This information is coded into the HTML of each web page and is what shows up for the page title and page descriptions in search results. Having good quality page titles and page descriptions helps the search engines find your web pages and know what search phrases you should show up for. Link building also plays an important role in increasing one's SEO. Google sees sites with a significant amount of quality inbound links as an authority in the industry they represent and a website they can trust to show in their results. Acquiring backlinks from other websites will increase your SEO. The quickest way to get started on your own is to list your website with reputable directory listings such as Yellow Pages or Angie's List. A good development firm can also offer ways to get you inbound links that may be specific to your industry and target audience. Depending on your budget and your SEO goals, there are further options to increase your SEO and page rank. Significant time can be spent researching and analyzing your website along with desired search terms, website performance, and competition within those search terms. These types of services are often part of an SEO campaign or an aggressive SEM campaign, also known as search engine marketing, to obtain that number one spot, and may require ongoing attention to achieve those goals. Let me leave you with a few quick tidbits about SEO. 70% of clicks in search engine results are on organic results. 75% of users never view the second page of search results. 80% of internet users use search. And there are over 1.4 billion searches every hour. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos and follow us on social media at Skyberry Studio. You can also find us on our website at skyberrystudio.com. If you have a question or topic you'd like to know more about, please leave a comment and it may be featured next week. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next week for another Quick Tip Tuesdays.